The Ashland Board of Aldermen voted in favor to move forward on a new outdoor amphitheater off of Highway 63 and Route H. ABC 17's Chanel Porter is live in studio tonight after checking out the site earlier today. And Chanel, the Ashland Planning Zoning Commission will now vote on this one week from today. Deb, phase one of this property will include a stage, a movie screen, parking lot, a beach, a concession stand, and a playground. Although members of the Board of Aldermen were happy about what this will bring to the community, residents in the area are not looking forward to the change. We don't like it. I mean, no one does. It's a shame that coming in is going to ruin our neighborhood with all kind of noise, and then people will be drunk after they you know, go to the music and stuff. Jerry and Ann Anderson have lived in their quiet neighborhood for 40 years now. They said they know all 59 of their neighbors are against the change. Can you imagine 59 of us don't want it? And we all have this one lane road that goes out. We all have to use it. Although a lot of the residents down this road are not too happy about the changes, the person in charge of the project, Nick Parks, said this area could be transformed into this. The event space would have a time frame and a noise level of 75 at the nearest residence. But one argued there are still parts of the project that need review. Yes, there's a track that is yet to be completed. There's discussion of a permanent sanitary sewer connection that's unresolved. There's discussion of need for a variance at the fire board, which is unresolved. Parks said moving forward, the goal is to get the movie screen and parking completed by this fall to have a few test movie nights. And make sure that uh, we, can, we can actually measure the decibels. Maybe we have one test concert to do that. We hope to be able to measure the lighting that the screen puts out. We'd also like to set up a GoPro camera, videotapes and traffic coming in and out during those first couple test movie nights. And Deb, although board members were in favor, Colbert did side with the neighborhood on this issue, saying that residents have testified that this would negatively impact their quality of life. All right, Chanel, thank you. And when completed, two movies are set to be shown on Fridays from 5 p.m. until midnight. Concerts will take place on Saturday ending at midnight, and the venue will also be available to rent to host private and public events.